Hey guys, it's Fani from Mrs. Mom's Homeschool. And welcome back to our channel. Today we have been invited to do a collaboration with Michelle over at Homeschooling in the Pines. And it is about poetry tea time. April is the month of poetry. And we have never done a poetry tea time, which we are going to start to incorporate into our week. Thanks. Thanks, Michelle, for the idea. So here's how, this is our first poetry tea time. Happy. Okay, now that's it. Now sit down and eat, Ireland. I'm so happy. <laughs> I'm so happy. I'm so happy you're happy. You like what? This. 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 This whole thing. Good. Mmm, you're like a little mouse. Let's read about mice. Mice like cheese. Mice. I think mice are rather nice. They're I like cheese. I have one too. Their tails are long, their face is small. They haven't any chins at all. Their ears are pink. Their teeth are white. They run about the house at night. They nibble things they shouldn't touch, and no one seems to like them much. But I think mice are nice. Do you like mice? Yeah. Do you have a poem you want to share? What shall we call my dear little doormat? I just love his tail. I sometimes call him Terrible John because his tail goes on and on and on. I sometimes call him Terrible Jack because his tail goes to the end of his back. And sometimes I call him Terrible James because he says he likes me calling him names. But I think I shall call him Jim because I am so fond of him. Very cute. We can share both. Or this one. This page is creepy. Why is it creepy? Hold on, Kaylee. Bug. Oh boy. Termite tune. That is the termite tune. That wood, a chair, a wooden spoon. Fat legs of pianos. They need to make a stool, a mantle. Uh -huh. Mommy, can you some? Put your finger across it. Can you help me make one? Can you help me yes. make a mantle clock, a windsill? Can you help me do it? Your little kitchen stool. We'll, we will gobble the foundation. And you will so, be walking uh, on a slant. Can you? I'm a If it's wooden, no, you can't. Got wood? 
if you would like to share or if you wouldn't do we care. He'll munch the bottom of your door. Then we'll chew our way across the floor. You baseboard roof and every wall. It's wood, it's good. We'll eat it all. Then when you have it anymore, we'll go and eat the house next door. God boy. <laughs> That's and cute. to the woman so elder okay. I said to the woman as she went by mm -hmm. down to the village to get some barley will you come with me no not I I met some rabbits as I went walking we got talking rabbits and died where are you going in your brown fur coats I said to the rabbits as they went by you like how they fade away yeah oh yeah oh, look he's hiding it's, it's a beautiful picture he's hiding okay. you gotta read that one yeah an empty swarm can do great harm. If I happen on by a chance, they'll soon dispense an armament to perform a great war dance to protect their nest, to defend their young, to save their queen. You will be stung, becoming victims uh -huh. in the path of wasps, aggressive, vengeful,